Detailed Knowledge on Elephants 1. Basic Elephant Information Did you discover that elephant actually means Great Arch in Latin? These creatures are definitely huge and amazing beasts. In actuality, the elephant is the world's largest living land mammal. Elephant males can reach heights of 4 meters and weigh up to 7 tons, while their female counterparts can still only reach weights of 3.5 tons. It takes a great deal of food to sustain an animal of such enormous size. They consume roughly 4-7% to of their body weight in food each day. That translates to finding and consuming a ton of food if you're an elephant. Because all that food must be digested and slept on, as one might anticipate, our elephant pals can produce up to 150 kilograms of excrement every day. Elephants exclusively consume grasses, herbs, fruit, plants, and trees because they are herbivores. Given that the average elephant lives for roughly 70 years, which is comparable to our own lifespan, their healthy, vegetarian diet is plainly beneficial to them. Although they typically only walk an average of 25 kilometers per day, they are actually quite agile and may move up to 195 miles per day. They can also run much more quickly than you would anticipate, easily achieving speeds of 40 miles per hour, which is much quicker than we can. Elephants are currently restricted to conservation areas and the savanna, having originally roamed all of Africa. Currently, there are 13 Asian countries and 37 African countries where African and Asian elephants can be found. There are actually three species of elephants, despite the widespread misconception that there are only two. Savanna of Africa, Loxodonta africana. Forest of Africa, Loxodonta cyclitus. Elephas maximus, Asian. On the African continent, there are actually two distinct species of African elephants, each with a distinctive culture and appearance. Elephants are kind, intelligent animals who require protection if they are to last for centuries as a component of our natural ecology. 2. Elephant Physiology What more do we know about the anatomy of these lovely animals other than the fact that they are large and of trunks? The top lip and the long nose combine to form the elephant's trunk. The trunk alone can be used as a powerful weapon and weigh up to 140 kilograms. A trunk can, however, also be used to push over a tree, pick up a feather, calm a troubled calf, and contain 12 liters of water. Elephants, in case you didn't know, also have tusks. Both male and female African elephants have this, which is comprised of ivory. The tusks, which first appear at around age 2, are essentially enlarged in size or teeth. The tusks of the males are large and can weigh more than 100 kilograms. Unfortunately, due to man's insatiable desire for ivory and the consequent killing of elephants for their tusks, elephant numbers have drastically decreased worldwide. To give you a sense of how many elephants are killed for their ivory, consider that there were 1.3 million elephants in the 1970s, but only 400,000 are thought to be alive now. Elephants have relatively huge ears as well. In order to assist the elephant to stay cool under the intense African sun, they built us ways to pump blood around them. The elephant becomes hotter the more its ears flap. An elephant, it is said, never forgets. This may be due to the fact that they are highly intelligent beings with large, 4 to 6 kilograms brains. Elephant skin can occasionally be up to 2.5 centimeters thick. Elephants utilize mud and dust baths to try to get rid of skin parasites, as well as to cool off, despite the fact that they are particularly susceptible to them. Elephants have six sets of teeth, which they continuously replace as they age. Most elephants start using their final set of teeth by the time they are 50 years old. 3. Social Behavior of Elephants Elephants are gregarious creatures that frequently coexist in huge groups. They are renowned for maintaining lifelong relationships with members of the same family and never deviating from their mothers. Elephants are a clear example of girl power, as females and their offspring live in breeding herds while men are frequently ignored. The matriarch, who is frequently the oldest female in the herd, is the normal leader, and the rest of the herd is made up of her own progeny. Being the oldest, she possesses the wisdom and experience necessary to secure the herd's survival through trying times. She will introduce them to food and drink that are outside of their typical sphere of influence while also teaching them how to avoid harm. Young females will typically remain with the herd while males, between the ages of 10 and 19, leave the herd to live a more isolated existence as bull elephants. Bull elephants, often known as bachelors, frequently create their own little groups with other male elephants. Mothers and their young are undoubtedly the centers of family life, while male elephants are frequently around, keeping an eye on their children. 
4. Communication in Elephants Elephants are extremely intelligent, gregarious creatures that communicate with one another in a number of ways. They enjoy communicating with one another by vocalizing a variety of calls and sounds, just like humans. According to research, up to 70 distinct calls, from the shrill cries of terror to the reassuring rumbles, have already been recognized. Additionally, they communicate using infrasound calls, which may be heard up to 14 kilometers distant. According to recent research, they might also be able to communicate via seismic waves that travel through the ground and are picked up by their perceptive feet. Elephants use odors to get information about other elephants and their surroundings, just like many other animals do. The chemical cues a female leaves in her urine and feces, for instance, can be used by a male to determine when she is ready to mate. All the neighborhood men will be aware of the ideal moment to vie for her love thanks to this and the period appropriate calls. Behind their eyes, in the temporal glands, elephants produce chemical secretions. Although its purpose is not entirely understood, it does seem to be connected to chemical communication. 5. Elephant Resemblance One of the most crucial aspects of nature is reproduction. Each species accomplishes it in a unique way, yet it all ensures their survival. Female elephants can give birth to up to 12 calves during the course of their lifetimes and are typically ready to become mothers at around 15 to 16 years old. Although we think the 9-month gestation time for humans is short, be grateful you are not an elephant. An elephant's average gestation lasts an incredible 22 months. It's been a long time. Male elephants do not reach their prime until they are approximately 30 to 35 years old, so female elephants must have a thing for older men. They go through a must period about now. Bull elephants that experience must on a recurring basis exhibit extremely aggressive behavior and experience a significant increase in their reproductive hormones. An elephant's testosterone levels during must might be up to 60 times higher than they are at other times. The dominant males may experience must for up to 6 months during which time they frequently cease eating for a few days. 6. Elephant Relationships and Love Elephants are reputed to mate for life. Even if this isn't always the case, animal scientists have demonstrated that they never leave their mates. They have a reputation for creating close, intimate relationships between friends and family. They frequently stay in the same groups their entire lives and can make friendships that last a lifetime. Elephants have also been observed crying over stillborn calves or baby elephants who do not survive the first few months of life. Elephants are also known to lament the loss of a loved one. Even now, it's not uncommon for family groups to visit the places where their friends or loved ones passed away and stay there for a while. Additionally, there is a lot of truth in the proverb elephants never forget, which aids in the development of long-lasting connections. Elephants require exceptional recall for survival in the wild, and they can recognize a former friend or family member just by the smell of their pee. Therefore, despite the fact that elephants may not be nearly as romantic as we would like to believe, there is plenty of evidence to suggest that they do create close relationships with their own social networks. Elephants value group membership since they might live up to 70 years in the wild. 7. Elephant Babies Facts There is no denying the cuteness of baby elephants. But when it comes to their newborn talents, they are likewise highly evolved and among the most advanced species. The longest gestation period of any mammal lasts up to 23 months in female elephants, often known as cows. It's not surprising that when newborn elephants are finally released into the world, they are rather intelligent little creatures after spending so long being cared for by their mom's belly. A baby elephant, known as a calf, is roughly 200 pounds, 91 kilograms, in weight and 3 feet, 1 meter, tall. When they are born, they have poor vision but, like human infants, they can identify their moms by touch, smell, and sound. The babies remain quite near to their moms during the first few months in order to get nourishment, warmth, and support. They are also quite hungry, and they can drink up to 3 gallons of breast milk each day. Elephants also take a while to wean because infants can nurse from their mothers for up to 10 years before finally stopping. Fortunately, the female elephant community is kind and helpful, and young calves are cared for by both their moms and other females in the herd. All of the girls in the group trumpet the news and announce the birth of a new baby. The calf must literally stand on its own four feet within minutes of birth. To get to their mother's milk, calves must be standing upright, otherwise, they would die. Their trunks are something they are not able to regulate very well for the first year of their life. Similar to young children, Elephants pick up their behavior from their parents and more seasoned family members, including how to effectively use their trunks. 
Elephant babies exclusively learn how to adjust to their new environments by imitating their mother's behavior over an extended period of time, much more so than other animals do. This implies that they spend a significant portion of their youth close to their parents and other family members. 8. Habitat Details for African Elephants Sub-Saharan Africa, the rainforests of Central and West Africa, and the Sahel Desert in Mali are all home to African elephants. Their Asian contemporaries can be found in Nepal, India, and Southeast Asia in scrub forests and rainforests. Elephants are powerful animals that have evolved to live quite well in dry, hot environments. They are herbivores, which means they eat grasses, leaves, roots, fruits, and other plant material but not other animals' flesh. They roam through as many as 37 nations on the African continent and are the gentle vegetarian giants of the African savannas. Elephants use their feet to pound and dig into dry stream beds and other areas in search of hidden water. They frequently dig very deep pits with their feet, trunks, and tusks, continuing until they find enough water for everyone to share. Predators like lions, jaguars, and leopards find it difficult to consume them because of their enormous size. The adults surround the calves in a circle at night to keep them safe. Their thick skin also makes it difficult to bite them. Forest elephants, which have evolved specifically to thrive in the forest ecosystem of the Congo Basin, are also found in Africa. These elephants are smaller and more adapted to living in the lush jungle since they have evolved to live in their own habitat. Unfortunately, African forest elephants are the species most at risk from poachers, and their population is constantly declining. 9. Information on Elephant Size The largest land creatures in the world today are African elephants. With a whopping 24,000 pounds, 11,000 kilograms, a shoulder height of 3.96 meters, 13.0 feet, and being at least a meter taller than the typical male African elephant, the largest African elephant ever discovered was discovered in Angola. The typical African elephant will weigh between 5,000 and 14,000 pounds and grow to a height of 8.2 to 13 feet, 2.5 to 4 meters, from shoulder to tip. According to National Geographic, this range is from 2,268 to 6,350 kilograms. Elephant males have the potential to get much bigger than elephant females. Female elephants, sometimes known as cows, are still enormous animals, but they only reach heights of between 9 and 13 feet and weights of 6,000 and 8,000 pounds. Ivory tusks, which are basically elongated incisor teeth, grow on both sexes. The male's tusks, which weigh anywhere between 110 and 175 pounds each, are longer and heavier. Tusks of females weigh about 40 pounds each. Elephants in Africa are renowned for having enormous ears. The vast surface area of their ears, which are thought to resemble the form of the African continent itself, serves to keep them cool in the scorching African sun. 10. Indian Elephant Information While we on the African continent adore and nurture our elephants, their Asian relatives equally need our respect. Although Asian and Indian elephants have different appearances from our African kind, they are still the same gentle giants who are adored all over the world. Indian elephants have evolved to live in the lush, damp, and humid environs of tropical Asia, and they are typically smaller in stature than African elephants. Asian elephants can also be distinguished from other elephant species by the size and form of their ears. Elephants from Africa have rounder, more rounded skulls. Asian elephants have a twin domed head with an indent in the middle, but the top of the head on African elephants is a single dome. African elephants have small, round lower lips compared to the long, tapering lower lips of Asian elephants. In contrast to Asian elephants, which only have tusks on some males and none on females, all African elephants have tusks. African elephants are reported to have larger ears that resemble a map of Africa, while Asian elephants are said to have smaller ears that resemble a map of India. Asian elephants do have smaller ears because they do not rely on larger ears to protect them from the intense African sun, even if this may or may not be the truth, 